What's going on, you guys? Um, I just got off of work. Uh, I'm sorry if my eyes look like this. I've been uh, crying. Um, so I called my boss yesterday and uh, asked him for a raise. And uh, he was like, uh, see me tomorrow, you know, after work. So I saw him and he said, basically, he just can't do it. Um, I'll be here two years in September. Uh, I do things, I go over and beyond. Uh, I do things that certain drivers don't do. Uh, it's been times where I'll stop at McDonald's and this is, you know, I'm not bragging about the things that I do. I'm not looking for no, you know, thank you or nothing like, I, I do stuff from the heart. Like, uh, it's been times I didn't stopped at Tim Hortons, uh, got, you know, like two dozen donuts and, you know, a big thing of coffee. It's been times where, uh, I didn't got the mechanics, you know, I'll stop at McDonald's and I'll get breakfast combos. I even get the two ladies in the office that do payroll and billing. I even, I, it's been times where I stopped at McDonald's and got them something to eat. You know, it's been like, and I'm not looking for anything in return. Like the stuff that I do is from the heart. But, uh, I'm not looking for nothing in return. The stuff I do, uh, for other people at the job come from the heart. Uh, not only that, uh, we drive some nasty raggedy trucks and it's only two local guys, me and this other guy. But, you know, don't matter how nasty, how raggedy the truck is, you know, I, I, I keep it clean. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but I'm, 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 I'm really hurt. Like I clocked out, got in my car and I cried like a baby because like, I feel stabbed in my chest. Like I, I really, really feel stabbed in my chest like i feel shot <laughs> with an invisible gun like i'm just hurt like i ain't i'm not even gonna hold you like i'm I'm just hurt and like i feel like i deserve it because like i be really be going over and beyond like i be going an extra mile like i do things that y'all don't see like I said, I be buying breakfast. I'm, I might stop at Tim Hortons. Like, I do stuff like the owner should be doing for his people. Like, these people work hard for you. We work hard for you. We make you a lot of money. And first of all, you a millionaire. And I, and I, and I didn't even, I, I didn't even give him a number on how much I want in a raise. You know what I'm saying? We didn't even get that far. The answer was no. <clears throat> And I already knew that. I already knew it was going to be no. You know, I called my mom and everything. And my mom, she hear the... She hear my voice. Man, she know I'm hurt. Like, for real. I, I, I'm really hurt. Like, going over and beyond and going an extra mile. It, it, it don't get you nowhere. It don't get you nowhere. And it, and it never will. Like nice guys finish last and, I, and i'm a very very nice guy like you know it don't it don't get you nowhere it didn't get me nowhere it didn't give me no raise or nothing like that like and it's not and it's not just uh uh i gotta manage my money better you know yeah i know i gotta manage my money better we all do but uh don't nobody appreciate the american truck driver don't nobody appreciate black men like putting color aside don't nobody appreciate truck drivers don't nobody appreciate employees like we really do a lot for these companies whether it be trucking or whether it be retail we do a lot and we and we really really get the short end of the stick don't nobody appreciate us for real like i'm really hurt like really really hurt like it's the day before my birthday and I'm just like really, really trying to keep it together because I like I'm really, really hurt for real, for real. 
I feel like a, a artist that in, that's got screwed out, out of their contract. You know what I'm saying? I really feel that way. Like if that's what it feel like, then I don't want no parts of it. But I'm but I'm hurt though. And I'm trying, you know, not to sh shed no tears on camera because, you know, but. Man, I'm going through it. I'm still going to do a cooking video. Uh, you know, I just had some Chick-fil-A hoping that hoping that'll make me feel better. But, you know, I'm still hurt. And, and and I love Chick Fil A, but can't nothing cure this pain. Like can't nothing cure it. Uh, being nice and going an extra mile, it don't get you nowhere. It don't get you nowhere. I swear to God, it don't. Uh, like, dude. I do a lot like it ain't even about him being rich it ain't even about these companies being rich it's like dog man you gotta throw me something extra you know what I'm saying I do a lot and you see that with your own eyes you ain't blind <laughs> like dude you your name ain't Stevie Wonder you see what I'm doing but dog you can't compensate like dog you ain't compensating me right foul you straight foul. But you know what? Uh, it, it's, it's really, really best that I put myself in a position where I can have my own and do for my own. And when I mean my own, my kids and my family. Like, I, I'm... I really want to punch a hole in the wall. I really do. Like, I just, I really want to just punch a hole in the wall. I'm just so pissed. I just need to have my own, my own business, my own trucking company. And just, just. Like, I've never be, been rejected. Uh by a woman and I know I can't compare it but like dude I like this is rejection for real it's like chasing a woman that you always wanted right and she tell you no <laughs> it, it hurts for real it, this is like this is almost close to the to the pain I had when my wife mm, when my ex-wife mm, what a divorce like dog this sh <clears throat> like, it's, it's, it's really really hurt it's almost like when she took him and moved out to Arizona like ah, this is eating me up this is really really chewing at me talking about he can't do it I get paid $26 an hour but, dog, that's still, still not enough, man. I got to put up with the drivers out on the road. Don't nobody know what the truck drivers be going through out here, man. It's a lot of pressure. It's a lot that we go through mentally. They're like, dog, y'all just don't get it. Jeez. Like, dog, I'm really, really hurt. Really hurt. really really uh it's like dude you playing games with me my name is xavier it's ain't playstation like dog i don't know why people think they can just toy with me as if i'm fisher price or something like and see i already knew the answer going in and i really didn't want to stop in his office i i really really didn't want to stop in his office but i said you know what Cause my mom gave me some advice. Just, just Xavier, son. Just hear him out. Just you asking for a raise. He said, "No, 
you gonna let me over or I'm gonna take it. But uh I me and my mom had a long conversation about it. And uh she said, you know, son, just hear him out. But I already knew. I asked you for a raise, right? You said uh a after your shift come in my office and I'll explain it to you. That lets me further know the answer. So I don't need no I have a dream speech. I don't need I don't I don't need your speech and all of that. Like see with me it's uh, I came I don't sugar I eat a lot of candy and I don't sugarcoat nothing. But dude I, I gave you a straightforward question. Can I get a raise? It's either a yes or a no. It's either you got it or you don't. Straight up. Like, stop playing with me. Like, stop. Like, outside of work, you can't play with me. You cannot just play with me. Period. I don't feel like you play. Play with me. Like, I'm really hurt. Like... All that, all that, me being friendly at work, being nice, uh, that's that's dead for real. I'm talking about cemetery. That's 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 over with. I'm done being nice. Ain't no coming to work with a smile on my face. Y'all demolish that. That's over with. Cause I, I I I'm one of those work. I'm one of those workers. It don't matter what job I'm at. It doesn't matter what industry I'm in. I come to work with a smile on my face. I'm always laughing, kiki, ha ha. You know what I'm saying? The girls in the office, they gave me a nickname called Giggles because I'm always laughing and smiling and everything. That shit dead. Like funeral home. Like that's over with. I'ma come in there and mean mugging straight up. Cause the y'all uh you hurt me so bad to the weird point that I would not satisfy y'all with a smile. I would not satisfy you with the with 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 with, with my laughter. Ain't nothing funny to me. This ain't no game. This real life to me. Like, dude, I need a raise. Like, I really need that. I deserve that. I know. I know. I, I'm valuable. I'm very, very valuable. Real talk. I'm a high value man at that job high value. I know I am. I know what I bring to the table and I know my worth and I know I'm worth more than $26 an hour. I know that I could go work at Chrysler for 28, starting at 28. But the problem with working at Chrysler is it's hard to get in there. So that's over with. So, uh, I applied at journeys, the shoe store, and I'm just waiting on them to, you know, call me back and, uh, you know, just leave it in God's hand and hoping they call me in a few days, you know, schedule an interview. But I'm only working at Journeys, uh, so I get some extra money and I can get me and my sister some shoes. My sister <clears throat> about to be 23 in May. So, uh... And me and my sister tight like vice grips. So the only reason why I, 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 I apply that journeys, and if it's in God's God's hands, I'm just doing this for the extra money. That that's that's number one, the extra money because I need it, and I'm and I get forty percent off, and I'm just doing it so get me and my sister some shoes, money, and get me and my sister some shoes. That's it. Ain't nothing more. Ain't nothing less. But I did that. I applied before. I applied this week before I even asked the owner for a raise. Uh, because, you know, and I'm only going to work at the shoe store on the weekend, Saturday and Sunday, because those are my off days, Saturday and Sunday. So, uh, sleeping in God's hands. Uh, so, yeah. Mm -mm. Yeah, I'm really, really, really hurt by this. For real, for real. 
getting a getting getting denied a raise. It's like, dude. It's, 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 I, I can't explain the pain to you. I really can't. I just know my eyes hurt because I've been crying. Like my eyes are literally just tired of crying. And uh, I'm not ashamed to cry. Real men cry. Uh, that's what I look at it as. I always look at it. Real men cry. I'm not afraid to show emotion. I'm human. So it's not wrong for me to shed a tear or tears. I'm not gonna hide my pain. <laughs> I'm not gonna sweep it under the rug like most people. I'm human. And that's all I'll ever be is human. So uh, I'm not I'm not you know shy when it comes to showing emotion. If I'm upset, you're gonna see it. If I'm if I'm uh, happy, you're gonna see it. So what but That's how, that's how, you know, I'm really, really hurt. Like, dude, I love Chick-fil-A. And, and, dude, even my favorite restaurant, my favorite food doesn't even cheer me up. Yeah, it's, uh... <clears throat> Francie, though, I'm really hurt. Uh, I, I really am. Like all that being nice and being friendly at work, that's like I said, they killed that. They 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 killed my spirit basically. They really killed my spirit. But <clears throat> I can't let that. Uh, I can't let them killing my spirit. I can't let that us uh, stop from, you know bringing you guys, you know, uh, freshing and good content, you know, the show must go on. So, yeah. Yeah, Francis, I'm, I'm really hurt. I'm really, really hurt. So, uh, man, I'm, I'm gonna be all right. I'm gonna be all right. I'm gonna be all right. But yeah, I'm on my way home. Uh, I don't have any plans for the rest of the day. It's like four o'clock. So, yeah. I don't even want to go to sleep. I just want to keep driving and driving and driving. That's all I want to do is just, just, just keep driving. I really don't even want to stop at the crib. I just want to keep driving and driving. You know? And I, I'm really uh, toe up. Really tore up. Like I said, this pain... This pain almost feel like a, a, a divorce pain all over again. Or, or, or your ex-wife moving the kids out of state. You know what I'm saying? It, it's that tight. No, for real. you guys watching I, I like I'd rather talking to people that you don't know talking to strangers you get more love and more support from a stranger than your own people for real It be the people that you don't know that show you the most love and most support for real.
Um, I'm in this video. Appreciate you guys watching. Uh, I'm gonna be all right. You know, I just I just gotta get this off my heart, and uh, yeah, I just gotta get this off my heart, and just I'm gonna be all right. Tomorrow's a new day, so yeah. Well, I'm gonna catch you guys in the next one. I love y'all, and thanks for watching.